This here's this week Starsky and Hutch. It's a fine film. Owen Wilson, Ben Stiller. Back when Ben was funny. I'm gonna read the synopsis for you. See, so you... here comes the fuss. Starsky takes the wheel. Hutch rides shotgun and comedy runs wild in this hilarious twist on the landmark buddy cop TV show. Ben Stiller, you got Owen Wilson, and it says here they bring a playful chemistry. Ben was fun and he was like the uptight sort. And then you got Owen Wilson, and he was the carefree, laid-back character, played by David Soul in the original Starsky Hutch, Starsky and Hutch, from the 70s. Then you also got Snoop Dogg, he's in it. And Snoop, he plays Huggy Bear. And Huggy Bear is the, uh, he's the man they go to for answers. Uh, Huggy, he ain't on the up and up, but... Huggy's there, and, and they protect him. Todd Phillips directed this here piece, uh, who also most recently did The Hangover, and now they're about to come out with Hangover 2, and I expect more of the same mediocrity and overratedness. So, directs this 70s groove in which uh, our guys here are stripped, and uh, their badges, right? Because what happened? I'm trying to remind myself. Duped by... Drug Kingpin played by Vince Vaughn. Now, Vince Vaughn, he was tough, but he's mean son of a bitch in this movie. I mean, you know, you've seen him mostly in, like, uh, Wedding Crashers and all his other films where mostly he's funny. Not Clay Pigeons and not, of course, uh, mm, that remake he did uh, where he was badass. What the fuck was that? What the hell was that movie? Son of a bitch. All right, here we go now. So... So they get, they go to this disco contest. They do some flow. It's funny. Uh, there's a scene with a pony, this horse. And I don't want to do a spoiler. That's what we call them, spoilers, when I give away interesting stuff that happens in the movie. And there's uh, Juliette Lewis. She's in it. She She's great. Uh, Juliette Lewis. She's in it. She's great. Uh, uh, Juliette Lewis. <laughs> My favorite part of this whole movie was... Uh, What's her name? Uh, Carmen Electra. Hold on. And that cute blonde. Ooh, I love so much. What her name? Hmm. Amy Smart. Amy Smart in that. And oh, Lordy, they look so cute. And Carmen Electra and their little asses and those little white tight t-shirts and the nice little ass and them little beach shorts. Look like Magnum P.I. shorts, but they were wearing their cheerleaders. Woo! Hmm. They hot. And so anyway, yeah, that's what happened. They took that Coke, and there's the Coke that you can't smell, and they took and they had themselves a party, and that was good. Uh, that was, uh, who in the hell was that, the party? Uh, Hutch and the two girls, and they had themselves a threesome, and they kiss. The girls kiss is good. This one here is widescreen version. If I were to synopsize this here movie, you got your good guys, they get suspended, Chief is played by a great black actor. I can't remember his name now. Southern draw of uh, Southern draw of uh, one of my favorite actors in this movie is Jason Bateman. He's real uptight. There's one funny scene where he wears the he wears the uh, suntan lotion, sunblock right on his nose. Looks like a real nerd. He's a real nevish character. That's Jewish. I was to rate this here movie. I would give this a good solid, oh hell, for a remake of some 70s show, they always try to do that. I'd give it an 8. I'd give it a square, honest 8. And I would say that the way it was shot, the picture quality, if you will, uh, I would give the picture quality a 7. Wasn't really ambitious, if I remember correctly. And then the sound quality, well, who gives a shit sound quality? How large television? And the DVD extras, oh, those are good, yeah. Bunch of deleted scenes. Commentary with Todd Phillips, and he goes on and on. He's kind of annoying. And that's about it. So I'd give it two thumbs up. I sure enjoy it. I would have liked to have been more helpful, really. And I know I wasn't, but 
most of the time I watch this many times. I must have seen this movie 12 times. But I'm always stoned or drunk or something when I watch this. Oh, this one girl, though, I forgot before I forgot. Oh, they interview this one gal, and it's a hot scene, and, and she gets undressed in front of them, and man, it's good. Now, that's the one I forgot about. They show her boobies from the side. She's beautiful, too, blonde girl. Don't even know who she is. That's worth watching. This here is Zeke Patton. I'm checking out over and out. Peace and I'm out.